Hey everyone, my name is Donald and in this video we're going to be showing you how to hide your elements in your header section of the header builder. Right now we have our logo, the inline navigation, two buttons, and then drop down navigation. I want to keep the logo shown on all devices, so we aren't going to mess with that one. I want to go ahead and hide the navigation inline on mobile devices. Keep this button with the text only on desktop devices, so hide this on mobile. And I want to show the button with the icon only on mobile devices only. And I want to go ahead and make this navigation drop down only shown on mobile devices. So what we're going to go ahead and do is I'm going to go ahead and remove this navigation inline from mobile devices. And to do that, we're going to go ahead and drop down to the customized section of the inline navigation. And you can see that we're over here. And then we're going to go ahead and navigate to customize. Once we're in customize, we want to go ahead and hide this on smaller devices. I'm going to choose tablets and phones to hide this one. Now, as we're going throughout this process, we can go ahead and check it over here on the left hand side. Click on this and we're going to have a drop down of the of responsive sizes of different devices. Once we click on these, we can see our element hides away on tablets, smaller tablets and phones. I'm going to go ahead and start hiding the button right here on smaller devices. Now, since the button's not taking up too much room, I only want to hide it on devices that are 480 or smaller. So let's go ahead and click the button, click on customize, and hide it right here on the very last device. Perfect. Right now we have to hide this button and this navigation on desktop because we don't want those to be visible there. Let's go ahead and click this button, click customize, and since we have the other button hidden on the very small so let's go ahead and click on this button. And since we have the other button only hidden on this small device, let's make this one hidden on all the other devices. Right now we have the navigation inline hidden on tablets and smaller. So let's go ahead and make sure that this navigation dropdown is shown only on tablets and smaller by checking the larger desktops. Let's go ahead and verify that we have everything looking correctly and we do. You're more than welcome to go ahead and save this from now and you're completely done making sure that you have different elements hidden on different sizes of devices so that you can have a completely responsive header. If you guys have any questions please let me know down in the comments below. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Thank you.